We are going to return right. We're going to line up, return right. I think they're going to line up over on this side. They're going to pour on this side. Okay? Hey, back guys, only about to the 10-yard line. The ball's not going to travel. Front line, be ready. Second line, be ready. You know what? If it gets and stuff, it's going to die. Okay? Hey, let's start it out right. Come on. To the house on three. One, two, three, to the house. On October 26, 2012, the Miller Grove Silver Eagles traveled to Reedsburg to face the Reedsburg Beavers for the Level 2 Division 3 playoff game. In the first half, both teams struggled with cold temperatures and sloppy field conditions. Monona Grove, however, struck first on a long pass to running back Evan Oldenburg. After an Andrew Shukart extra point, MG was up 7 to nothing. Reedsburg came back with a tough running attack, eventually breaking free for a long rushing touchdown to even the score at seven apiece. But in the winning seconds of the first half, MG pulled out a trick hook and ladder play from quarterback Fred Percy to running back James Conner, who then lateral to Marcus Goff for the touchdown. Second half, Monona Grove scored again on a long rushing quarterback keeper from Brett Percy. <laughs> Neither team led up intensity, and the entire game was hard fought on both sides. Monona Grove then broke free on another rushing touchdown from Edmund Oldenburg, put Monona Grove up by 21. Reedsburg made several attempts to get in the end zone one more time, but the Silver Eagle defense held strong. When time ran out, the final score was Monona Grove 28, Reedsburg 7. Win advances the Silver Eagles to level three of the Division Three playoffs where they will play the nine and one Mount Horup Vikings at Monona Grove. Oh, congratulations, Mike. Oh, thank you. Uh, Third fall win. Um, it seemed like uh, that hook and ladder hole play there right before after kind of sparked uh, the offense and sparked yeah, you guys. Well, absolutely. I mean, that's one of those big plays that's kind of a killer to them. Uh, in the second quarter, no question about it, we know that they were the better team in the second quarter. They were uh, rambling and we were, we were, you know, just trying to catch our breath no question about it but that's what's great about this team is when things don't go well they still found a way and I think that's a sign of a very scary and dangerous team uh, yeah it seemed like Reesburg did a pretty good job of keying in on James kind of bottling him up but then Percy has yeah, probably run and of the year. and yeah, that was an unbelievable run. But uh, you know, you take what you get. They had some nice plays, and sometimes things luck out in their way. But to be honest with you, I thought every one of our kids came through, did a great job. I'm extremely proud of them. Uh, and defensively too, it seems like the unit's getting better at the right time. Yeah, well, we gave up the one run, and we had to make some adjustments. That outside dive, the keeper was just killing us, and they do such a great job of it. I mean, give them credit. Uh, Pottinger and their whole staff, they do a, a, fa a fantastic job. Uh, and give our kids credit because we did adjust to it. Took us a while, but uh, hey, we found a way, so I'm really proud of our guys. Yeah, Sam Welsh, uh, great game. Nice to see that kid. Uh, I know he had a couple of big interceptions. It was an year, interception, so. not a lateral. And the referee came over and said if that ball would hit the ground, it would have been a, a dead ball. So, yeah, you got to count that as a pick. But he was in the right spot, covering his responsibility, which was pitch man, and just happened to pick off the forward pitch. So. Extremely proud. Sam made a great play, and as well as the interception uh, down there as well. Uh, now Mount Horeb next week, then. Yep, Mount Horeb. Uh, did they win? What was the final? They were um, killing 42 to seven in the third quarter. Yep. Um, yep. So Mount Horeb, uh, they're a great football team. Uh, they do a great job. No one's really found a way to stop them this year, so it'll be a big task on our part. Well, good luck, Coach. Thank you. Win. Keep it going.